The Red-Eyed Tree Frog's Resilience In the heart of the lush Costa Rican rainforest, there lived a vibrant community of animals, each with its unique qualities and characteristics. Among them, there was a red-eyed tree frog named Raphael. With emerald skin, striking red eyes, and the ability to leap from tree to tree, he was the envy of the jungle. The Misfortune of a Monsoon The monsoon, with its relentless rain, continued for days, causing the riverbanks to flood and the canopy to sway under the weight of the water. The normally vibrant and colorful jungle was shrouded in a melancholy mist, but the animals refused to be defeated by the elements. They shared their shelters, food, and comforting calls. During one particularly fierce downpour, as Raphael clung to a branch, he noticed a group of desperate baby birds stranded in a nest on a neighboring tree. The nest was perilously close to breaking away and being swept away by the raging river. Despite his own dire situation, Raphael couldn't bear to see the baby birds in such danger. Summoning all his strength and resilience, Raphael made a daring leap across the rain-soaked leaves and branches, using his sticky toes to grasp onto the edge of the nest. With the rain pounding around him and the river surging below, he carefully carried each baby bird, one by one, back to his own tree. The jungle's animals watched in awe and admiration. The next morning, the rain subsided, and the jungle began to dry out. The baby bird's parents returned to thank Raphael for his bravery and kindness. The entire jungle, inspired by his selflessness, broke into joyful songs and dances, celebrating the resilience and compassion that bound them together during the monsoon. Raphael, although tired and worn from the ordeal, felt a deep sense of satisfaction, realizing that the jungle was not just a place of beauty but a community of animals who looked out for one another in times of need. This act of kindness and bravery during the monsoon became a heartwarming tale that was shared throughout the rainforest, serving as a reminder that even in the darkest of times, compassion, and selflessness can lead to moments of true heroism and unity. The Envious Boa Constrictor Boris, the boa constrictor, had failed in his first attempt to capture Raphael. However, his envy and desire for attention continued to gnaw at him. He couldn't stand being overshadowed by a small tree frog any longer. Boris was determined to devise a more cunning plan to catch Raphael and prove that he was the mightiest creature in the jungle. He enlisted the help of a chameleon named Carlos, who was known for his ability to blend seamlessly into his surroundings. Together, they devised a scheme to lure Raphael into a false sense of security. Carlos would disguise himself as a harmless tree branch while Boris hid in the foliage, ready to strike when Raphael least expected it. Raphael, unaware of their plot, continued to go about his daily activities in the jungle. Boris and Carlos set their trap during the night when the moon was hidden by thick clouds. Raphael, thinking he was safe, hopped onto the branch where Carlos was concealed, and that's when Carlos revealed himself, capturing Raphael with his sticky, lightning-fast tongue. However, just as Boris was about to constrict his prey, the jungle's animals sensed danger. The chattering monkeys, screeching birds, and croaking frogs united in a cacophonous alarm. Their combined efforts caught the attention of the jungle's protector, a wise old jaguar named Isabella. Isabella, with her stealth and strength, arrived at the scene, and in a flash, she pounced on Boris, causing him to release Raphael. The red-eyed tree frog escaped yet again, this time thanks to the timely intervention of a true guardian of the jungle. Boris slithered away, humbled by the experience, realizing that it was not by trying to overshadow others but by contributing to the harmony of the jungle that one earned respect and admiration. Raphael, though initially frightened, recognized that the jungle's unity and watchfulness were what truly kept everyone safe. The jungle came together to celebrate once more, not in rivalry, but in gratitude for their shared bonds and their protector, Isabella. The tale of Boris's foiled plan served as a lasting reminder that jealousy and deceit could only lead to one's own downfall, while unity and harmony made the jungle a place of strength and beauty. The Resilience of the Red-Eyed Tree Frog After the thwarted attempt by Boris, the jungle was more united than ever before. Raphael's bravery during the monsoon and the collective effort to save him from the treacherous scheme of the envious boa constrictor had demonstrated the importance of resilience and unity. Inspired by these events, the animals of the rainforest held a grand assembly, where they shared stories of courage and cooperation. Each creature had a unique tale to tell, emphasizing how their own strengths were only enhanced when they worked together with others. As the discussions continued, a newfound spirit of camaraderie permeated the jungle. The animals realized that the rainforest's incredible diversity was its greatest strength. The colorful birds, agile monkeys, creeping insects, 
and graceful predators each had a role to play in maintaining the balance of the jungle. They now understood that they weren't competitors but collaborators in a grand, intricate web of life. Raphael, at the center of this transformation, became a symbol of resilience and unity. He was honored for his bravery during the monsoon and celebrated for his compassionate nature, which had even extended to the rescue of the baby birds. Raphael's red eyes, which had once been a symbol of envy, were now seen as a sign of his strength and determination. The jungle thrived, not just as a result of individual accomplishments but because of the collective spirit of its inhabitants. They found joy in celebrating one another's unique traits and working together to protect the beauty and balance of their rainforest home. The moral of this story resonated deeply within the hearts of those who heard it. Just as the rainforest flourished when its creatures stood together, so could the world, as long as people embraced diversity, overcame adversity through resilience and unity, and appreciated the strength that came from working together to protect the wonders of our shared planet. The End Don't forget to subscribe.